you guys, Sean C. Phillips here on my brand new Dollar Tree Dollar DVD and Blu-ray hunting video. Yes, the Dollar Tree now has in brand new Dollar DVDs and Blu-rays. Really looking forward to seeing which new ones they have. You know, fingers crossed they have them because I have not called any of the locations. I usually call just to see, but I feel like they've probably been out for a little while because I was away uh, this past weekend in uh, Pittsburgh. And, you know, that's when I had heard that they had some in and I went to some of the stores and they had like maybe like each of them like 10, 15 movies. There's like nothing left and it looked like a couple new things, like a handful of newer ones. So I think they might have been out a little bit in some locations. But what's interesting about this time around uh, with the movies is they were getting them in. Um, you know, uh, months back they were kind of like every few months, every month and a half, every two months, sometimes every month. But recently though, they were every like three weeks and like they were much more frequently. They were at least every single month. And sometimes before a full month they would have new ones out. This time around, though, it's been quite a while. It's been a lot longer that you know for them, them to have actually gotten new ones. So, looking forward though to seeing what they have. So, let the Dollar Tree Dollar DVD bin Blu-ray hunting video begin. Into the first Dollar Tree we go. But right here, though, in the front, though, like the deal of the week they're having here is just like kind of pans for turkeys and stuff like that. But I've seen some of the stores having them in the front this time around. They used to always have them like that, but lately they haven't in a long time. There are a whole bunch of like boxes over here. I don't think any of those are movies though. It says like alcohol and stuff like that here. Yeah, it looks like just like a whole bunch of different like alcohol things and stuff like that here. Well, let's see, usually they would put them down though in the electronics area, kind of like mixed in down here. Let's see though. Let's see if they're down here. I see a couple. Let's see. Yeah, see this one? That's it. I'm not even going to go through this one. They don't have anything new here. This is like always kind of the one location that is always kind of like, when it comes to the movies, like miss and miss. Like they never seem to have them in here. I don't know why. I, I, it's like, it's not, it's kind of like a, a mess in this one. It's like, oh, cool. What's going on in here? But yeah, we're gonna leave this one and head to another one. Like I said, this one does not seem to have anything movie-wise at all. And look at this, this area is like all blocked off and everything with stuff. Yeah, it's like all like stuff all over the place in here. Into the second Dollar Tree we go. And we'll see what they've got in this one. This one though, I have found stuff in here in the past. I don't see a thing on the door though that says it. it's like they're advertising like butter on the door over here. But let's see if there's anything in the front. No, in the front here, it's all the pipe and the pans and stuff here as well. Let's, let's see down here though in the electronics. I think it's like over here is where they put them. But look, yeah, see in this one too, down in here, it's just like. Yeah, there's definitely nothing in everything. They've had these ones forever. These deep, these deer, lemon Linda one. There's like a Santa one. But yeah, like nothing in here. Oh, like that's it. Oh, there's another random one over here. Another, another random movie over here too. Kind of sporadic over here. But I have two more locations that are pretty good ones. Well, technically three ones. So we'll see. We'll hopefully find one that has got some out. Into the third Dollar Tree we go. Now we'll see, this one here is, is promoting, um, they have the, the roasting pans and then they're also promoting Cool Whip. But we'll see if they've got anything here. No, it's the pans here, all the roasting pans. Let's find the section. I did end up just calling a second ago the one big location that I really like. It usually has the movies. And then the woman that picked up said, oh yeah, yeah, um, I think we do because this guy was in here yesterday and he bought tons of them. So hopefully he didn't buy up all the good ones. He, he probably did. She was acting like he bought up like a huge amount of them. I feel like the movies would have been around here, but I don't even see a spot for them. That's, uh, yeah, they, that, that area, but there wasn't like anything over there. No, these are all the picture frames. No, it doesn't look like they have any in here at all. I'm gonna ask the one woman to see if yeah. she saw any, but no, I don't see any in this location. Yeah, I just asked and she's like, no, uh, 
you know, we, we don't have any more ones. And I just saw like two random ones sit in this one spot. So there was, was like none. It was that same one I saw in the first store. This one though, I usually had had them. I, I would have thought they would have had them out because like I said, I just called the one location because I wanted to see if like any of them around here at all have them. And they, like I said, she was saying that someone bought a whole ton of them. So probably I'm expecting like all the Blu-rays to be picked over. There'll probably be like not, no Blu-rays left, but fingers crossed we'll see. There, Like I said, there's that one and there's like one other one and I might come across another one, but we'll see. Hopefully I can at least find one location that has some new ones. Into the fourth Dollar Tree we go. Now this is the one though that always has the movies. This is the one I just called a minute ago too. So... They, they never in this particular location though have them in the front they have like a big section and they have and their section is like enormous of movies but like i was saying though you know they said that somebody did buy a bunch so we'll see you know what's left and everything I, i'm hoping that there's still some i'm hoping the guy didn't go and like buy like like everything or something because he was acting like he bought tons let's see no oh like oh, oh look and yes, I'm going to be touching a lot of stuff. Now, I want to make sure to state, I'm touching stuff, but before I do this, what I do is I, I, sanit I you know, uh, use hand sanitizer before I come in, and then the second I leave, I sanitize again. You know, and I don't touch my phone. Basically, I do this all in one take, so I don't touch my phone again. I also have stuff to clean the phone, but there is a lot. So I'm glad I found one that had, well, they don't just have some, they have tons. So. I don't even know how I'm gonna go through this. I'm gonna have to like, like, cause they're all on top of each other. So I'm gonna have to just sort of go through these. They have like Superman three here. Let's see, like, these are a good ones to come across because I, I've been talking about this in the past. These, these are from, um, well, this is actually the, not the, this is so funny. This is like a different, I guess the Canadian release, but this is on um, the movie 99 Homes. And this came out from Broad Green Pictures in, you know, the US and that company's out of business. So all their releases are really rare now, and, you, and they, they pop up here and there though in the Dollar Trees. This is actually a pretty good movie. I already have this one uh, on the um, a Blu-ray, I believe a Blu-ray of this one. This is actually a pretty good movie. But that's so funny, they have a different, like the Canadian one here. But let's try and figure out how we're gonna do this. I, I don't totally know. I guess let's start down here. I'm gonna have to just sort of move things around, live by the night. So there are Blu-rays in here. So let's see how in the world to do this. There's, hey Dougie, I remember seeing this last time. It kind of looked like a, like a bit of a, of, a, of, a, of a turd a little bit. This kind of weird thing. I'm gonna have to move things everywhere. I wish there was like a card or something that I could, you know, do to look at these. What's this, Quantum Voyage? I don't know this one here. Not the McDowell movie, but Dean Cain. Let's see, some Blu-rays, Raging Phoenix, The Sweeney, Son of Bigfoot. I've never seen that when it came out, like in the store. Rampage, Road Warrior. I think they had that last time around. Let's see, what are these ones here? Street. Let's see. Yeah, see, they fall out. And there's like a random dollar bill down here, too. Unless that fit fell out of my pocket or something. I don't know. It's like finding everything in here. Uh, the Real Jungle Book Animals. Is a Harry Potter DVD game? Great family adventure with your DVD remote. That's kind of cool. I might actually get that thing, like a DVD game of Harry Potter. Like what a weird random thing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get that for a dollar. What a weird thing to see. I don't even remember when that came out. I know they used to do stuff like that, some DVD games, but that's kind of cool. Let's see, Christmas Switch, Get Shorty. What is this one here? Kirk Cameron thing. Yeah, I don't watch his stuff. Uh, straight out of Oakland. Let's see, what, Santa's Boot Camp. There's a lot of Christmas ones in here. Yeah, Christmas Boot Camp. I do not know what that one is. And here's one here, interesting. Clay. I think it's like a BBC one. BBC America one. I might get that one. That's an interesting looking one. Danny Trail, triple, triple feature here. With Beware, there's this Top Cat Begins. Blade Runner, they have a Blade Runner, the final cut. That's cool, the DVD of that one. Welcome to Sweden, the complete uh, first season of that one. What is this weird, like, squirrel movie? 
super fur ball. Oh, that's like a cheesy looking, like real bad, like CGI, you know, for like thing. That's my have to get that. An asylum one, Ben Hur. See Jackson, Jackson Bolt. There's like a ton in here. Race time. Live by night. The DVD of that one. A zombie Massacre Two. Wild Things. Chips. Wolves IMAX, like a Van Damme one. A Lake Shark. A Lake Fear the Swamp. Let's see, if I move them like this, I can probably. Afterlife, another BBC one here. That one's kind of interesting. These ones are always kind of good. A lot, there's a lot of these pretty good BBC uh, original like miniseries movie ones. It's another Superman 3, Ozzy, Blade Runner Final Cut, another Road Warrior, Voyager. What's this one? Intruders. Did I put that one up here already? Intruders? I don't know, that one's not, doesn't look like it's as much horror, I don't know. What is this one here? Patricia Arquette movie? The Wannabe? I don't know anything about that one. Another copy of Clay. Dragons Dungeons and Dragons. My Name is Doris. This is actually a pretty good uh, Sally Field movie here, if you guys have never seen that one. I think I've seen that here in the past, though. Then there's a lot to go through in here. A Twilight one. Breaking Dawn, Crazy Love. I don't know what this is? It's like the guy has a real crazy look. I don't know what that is. Luna. What is this movie? Another BBC one. There's a lot. The Benefactor here. Fist Fight. So here's another Blu-ray. That was a pretty fun movie. Tammy. Harbor Bosses 2. Big Mama. Big Man Japan. Krampus, The Devil Returns, here. Seeds of Yesterday, Dragon Slayer, Magic Kids. It's kind of a weird looking one here too. I don't know anything about this one. Oh, well, they have the Eclipse. Blu-ray here, so they do have some Blu-rays. This looks like this Canadian release in addition to that one here as well. Superman 2 uh, DVD here. Monster Family. Barbershop. This, I think this is the third Barbershop movie. This one I remember being pretty good. Air. American Dream. My Giraffe. There's some like really strange movies, like some weird movie this kid was a giraffe. There's no way to look at these though without like messing everything up. They're already kind of in here in a weird way. Uh, Boo. Some of these ones I know were old. I remember seeing these the last time around in here. Uh, what is this? Race Time? Some strange animated one. Not as much horror ones in here. There's like mixed in some. Perfect, tra perfect Trap? The world is like a weird leprechaun thing. What is this from 2018? It's a, it's a really strange looking movie. And there's, there's some strange movies in here. Like, like I don't even remember seeing any of these at Walmart or anything in 2008. Because like a lot of times these are stuff that was in Walmart, you know what I mean? And then, but I don't even recognize seeing them then. Ray Mysterio collection here. That's cool, WWE one in here. You don't see WWE in here too often. What's that, Invisible? Invisible Sue? Another weird one. Seems like they have a lot of Viva ones, that company. Road Warrior, more Road Warrior copies. Let's see, what is this, Black Mass? That's a good Johnny Depp movie, I like that one. Ava's Possession, that's a horror one. Uh, the Perfect Trap, another copy of that. Men with Brooms, like a Leslie Nielsen movie, I, and that's a Canadian release. They got a lot of Canadian things in here. Comedy with Sweep Your Feet, 
Yeah, I've never seen that Leslie Nielsen movie. I think I looked through these ones. Krampus. Legend of Hawaii. End of the World. I think I showed those ones. More Road Warrior ones. Another Ray Mysterio copy. Stuart Little. Stuart Little 2. That's a cool the double feature of both of those ones. Diamond Heist. Ray Mysterio. Doctor Who. Dystoria. Yeah, so even though that guy came in here and bought stuff, there's still a lot of stuff in here. Tommy Boy, that's a cool one to see. I already have this one, but you know, that's great for a dollar. Blu-ray of Tommy Boy. Band Slam. I don't think I ever watched this one. This Vanessa Hutchins movie. Let's see, what is this? Finding Phil. This is Dystopia. Dystopia. Uh, 1517 to Paris. That was the Clint Eastwood movie. I think I showed these ones down here. What is that plant? Uh, Pagan Warrior. Invisible Sue. Another copy of that one. Fairy Friendships. What is this thing here? Got triple feet or double, four movie feature thing here. A bunch of animated ones. Bloodlands. I think this is. I remember this being pretty good with Pollyanna McIntosh movie here. Outlaws. Riddle House. There's another Blu-ray of Chips. There's a Matchstick Men movie. I don't know if I ever watched this Nicolas Cage movie. This is one I don't know why I never watched that one. I don't know if there's a Blu-ray of that one or not. The House. That was alright. I mean, there was kind of, it was, wasn't like amazing, but it was okay. The Institution here. That's a horror one. I have that one. Another copy of the Harry Potter DVD game. This fight. Look at this. Here's the Hunger Games. And it's like the Canadian one. Was this the Canadian edition here? Yeah, the Canadian one on the back here. It's funny, how, like I said, how many of these Canadian editions they have in here of stuff. Diamond Heist. Play. Oh, here's um, Friday the 13th, the killer cut. So the Friday the 13th remake. Uh, Belco Experiment. They've had this the past couple times. Going in Style. This is a pretty funny movie with Morgan Freeman, Michael Caine, and Alan Arkin. That was pretty good. That's one I have already, though. Sleeping with Other People. Jason Sudeikis. Adam Scott. I don't know this movie at all. There's another Canadian one. I don't know. I'll look this one up. I don't know anything about this one. The covers kind of made it look to like a Harbor Bosses kind of thing. Ouija 3. Forbidden Empire, Boundaries, Stage Fright, Iron Wolf, Chappie, so there's a, there's a DVD here of Chappie, Lake Fear 3, so down here they have Lake Fear uh, 1 as well, and a My Giraffe there, Blood and Vikings, I see a Cat Williams like stand-up comedy special. That's a cool one too. I have this already, but Friday, Friday for a dollar on Blu-ray. Fame. So this is this. It's the original one. I think this might have been the remake. I think another double, a triple feature one here. Ghost Hunters, season nine, part one. London Spy, Easter Want kind of thing. Let's see Snow Queen two. The American Dream. Put us down here. Checkmate. Race Time. Big Man Japan. Another copy of Tammy. Magic Mike. So another Blu-ray. So there's a lot of Blu-rays. This is some kind of like a Lego Friends Together thing. Another Barbershop. More Friday. Milton's Secret. You can call that. Matchstick Men. The Offering, so there's another horror one here. They have a bunch of copies down there, a Murder Party, a Halloween Scooby-Doo one. That's called Halloween Scooby-Doo Volume 3. Her name is Doris. Voices from the Grave. Like I said, definitely a lot of stuff in here this time around. 
Oh man, when you like stoop down like this, it's not easy on your back. <laughs> What's this one here? Mom, mur Mom, Murder, and Me. It's like a, when they were the broom and stuff. I don't know what this one is. And this one, it's in, in is this, I think this is in French. Yeah, see, you see that side, it's in French and English. So that's kind of, like I said, it's very interesting how many um, French copies of stuff in here, French Canadian copies of things they have in here. But definitely a lot of stuff in here this time around. Yeah, so I ended up getting a couple different ones in there, but I'm like, I'm wondering though, because like the woman was saying, oh, someone bought tons of them. So I'm thinking like, man, there was that already that many there. It was that like difficult to look at them and you have to move everything around to try and see them. There's like no other way to do it uh, without like moving everything all over the place. But I can only imagine how much was there, you know, yesterday if he bought tons of them. Uh, so I don't even know how many days they've been out for. But in there though, I ended up getting that movie that Sleeping With Other People, which I don't know for sure if I've ever seen this one. Since it's like the, you know, the Canadian, cover I don't know if maybe I saw with like a different cover on it so then I don't even recognize that I've seen it or not um, then I got that um, you know men with brooms movie with Leslie Nielsen which looks interesting like I said this is one of those Leslie Nielsen movies that I had never seen before uh, the other one here is that weird looking one the perfect trap <laughs> strains looking like sort of seems like a home alone kind of thing I don't even know like a weird like wizard kind of goblin character on the back it's like it's like the strangest thing i've cover i've seen in a long time the magic kids movie which looks like kind of like a harry potter kind of knockoff kind of movie or something like that uh and then the bbc one you know afterlife which looked interesting here the other one was on um, this strange looking super fur ball like this is so cheesy looking and strange um and then I got that Harry Potter interactive game just because it was kind of like, I don't know, it would become kind of a funny thing to look at. Because uh, I, I remember when they were doing these, like they did like games you could play with the DVD. And it was just like a weird thing to see. Uh, and you wonder, how did that show up in there now? Because it's been, that's from like 2001 or 2002 or something. And the other one I got was that movie Clay, which looked interesting. But let me know in the comments below though, guys, if you guys went to Dollar Tree, let me know, you know, what your store had. If you guys, if you saw, any, you guys saw anything different than the one that I was in had. And like, let me know too, like what new things that you guys have picked up there or anything like that. But anyway though, guys, like I always say, if you guys enjoy these videos, definitely give this video a thumbs up. Thanks again for watching and subscribing. I'll see you guys later.